In this video, we will discuss using Walmart as a supplier with SKU Grid. The Walmart Marketplace allows both items that are shipped and sold by Walmart.com and items that are shipped and sold by third-party merchants, like Hay Needle or Unbeatable Sales, for example. Some users find that they only want SKU Grid to consider their item as in stock if Walmart is shipping and selling the item, while others are okay with using third-party merchants. It's a personal preference, but there's a special way that you need to enter your URLs when adding your Walmart items to SKU Grid to ensure that the items are tracked properly. Take a look at this item. Notice how in the top right hand corner it states that the item is sold and shipped by Walmart. But if you look further down, you will see one other seller and it says that it is sold and shipped by Design Tactics. This is a third party merchant seller. If you are listing an item and you only want it to be considered in stock if Walmart is selling and shipping the item, then you need to add pound SKU opt colon Walmart to the end of the URL as shown. If however you are okay with using either Walmart or the third party merchant sellers on an item, then you would need to add pound SKU opt colon all to the end of the URL when adding the item to SKU Grid. Otherwise, if Walmart runs out of stock on an item like this and only the third party merchant is available, SKU Grid would see the item as out of stock. Here's another example. This item is sold and shipped by Hay Needle. Further down, you will see that there is one other third party merchant seller on this item named Home Square. Walmart is not selling and shipping this item at all. It's only available via third party merchants. In order to get SKU Grid to read this item as in stock, assuming you are okay with using third party merchants, you will need to add pound SKU up colon all to the end of your Walmart URL. Otherwise, they would be excluded and your item would be seen as out of stock. Thanks for watching and we will see you in the next video.